Hello, hello, and welcome to Games Revisited. It's episode 129, and we're continuing our playthrough of Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic 2 The Sith Lords. We spent uh, an extended period of time making sure everybody was up to date. We had a couple of conversations. We got a couple of the droids some bonuses, which will be very helpful in a little bit. We're going to do one more round of checking in with the crew, and then we are going to kick off the final quest line. And if you want to start singing the final countdown to to the final quest line, uh, go for it. Oh, oh I thought something was going to happen. All right, first things first. Uh, I wanted to talk yes, to him. General. There we go. That's the conversation that I wanted. I'm curious, you can only have that on on the Evan Hawk. I wish to train you in the ways of the Force. Under your guidance, I feel like I could overcome my anger. Um, then we have no time to waste. Uh, the Force is strong, but I fear your anger would lead you to the dark side. I have the same fear as you, General. I've seen the crimes of fallen Jedi. I'm afraid yeah, I that you have. too easily travel down that same path. If you don't mind, there are some repairs that need my attention. Oh. All right. Yes, General. I wish to train you. All right, then we have no time to waste. And how's that for a strange little training session? That's a lot of meditation. I mean, we got a little droidy thing. I can't give him a lightsaber. To... Oh, there we go. How come he's the only one that got an extended training montage? Like, everybody else, you do a brief meditation, and then it just, like, skips and... Ha-ha! You've reached your first level. Oh, that looks familiar. Close your eyes. Something, something, something clumsy and random as a blaster. Baudur has now become a Jedi Guardian. Yeah! Alright, uh, I'll probably have to do something with him when I next exit the ship. Oh, and I should have a... Yeah, I've got a lightsaber already ready for him. Let's, uh... Alright. Is there someone that you need killed, Master? Uh, we we'll just... Alright. You stop asking Statement. me that. Master, assassination is my primary function. It is only expected that when you speak to me, it is to give me the order to kill. Uh, well, you know. No, it isn't. So stop asking me that, or I order you to stop asking me who I need killed. No, it isn't. Statement. Oh, very well, Master. No doubt you are bothering me because you wish to interrogate me with harmless, non-lethal questions. Uh, Perhaps you're expecting you something different? Freighter scrubbed, or an exciting alien text translated? My circuits are abuzz with anticipation of what your next task will be for me that does not involve ending the life of an organic meat bag that deserves death. Actually, I did have some questions. Statement. Ah, more questions. Wonderful. Uh, Why did you ask me about Oh, that's right cuz uh I need to get to, I need to get to him talking about killing Jedi. Uh that is how you unlock a conversation that grants you some bonuses. Um All right, let's start with uh do you know anything about the Sith hunting us? I do not. I am afraid I have been out of touch with the Sith for many years. This new Sith threat fights differently than the ones I was familiar with. These seem to favor stealth yeah, and assassination to I also noticed that for a game about Jedi, we haven't run into too many Sith. Uh, any ideas where they might be striking from? No, no, Master. The Sith had many hidden bases and strongholds before and during the Jedi Civil War, and I doubt the Republic found them all. Yeah, you Harry, and me both. It is possible that the Sith still hold one such base, if not several. 
consolation. But I would not worry, Master. I imagine it will not be long before their murderous hands try to seize you by the throat. Oh, thank you for that. Metaphor. Like crick beetles during the Brightland seasons? Alright, uh... I have some other questions. Ah, more questions. Wonderful. Alright, um... Hmm. Why'd you ask about the Mandalorian Wars? Sure, we'll try that one. Why? Because your actions then and now are related, and I feel I need some context. I confess to being somewhat needy that way. Uh, what do you mean? Statement. Sometimes, Master, it is difficult for meatbags to step back and gain some perspective on death and its importance in their insignificant lives. Explanation. You see, Master, assassination is such a versatile tool. I have seen the removal of a single target a versatile tool, have far-reaching consequences for a nation, world, even a galaxy. The repercussions of even the smallest lives, whether dead or alive, can have profound implications on history. But surely you realize this. <laughs> That's a very human perspective. Statement. Master, please, any comparisons between me and your meatbag status leaves a fluctuating, intermittent <laughs> charge through my control clusters. I was only trying to bring death. And its impact to your attention. I had some other questions Statement. then. Ah, more questions. Wonderful. Who was your previous master then? Answer. Oh. Master, ironically enough, I seem to have developed a sudden bout of Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Statement. Um. Ah, more questions. I guess the problem is, is that I haven't had him out enough to to win or lose influence. I, I probably should have brought him along on more more of the missions than I have. Um, let's see if anything. Let, let's see about the the HK units. Statement. What of them? Do you know where these clones are being created? You cannot visit the HK factor at free will. It will trigger further along at the main plot. Okay. Statement. Um. You know what? I'm not even going to worry about it. So it looks like I'm not going to be able to get the, the last little bit out of HK. Because I can't get the influence needed to make that happen. Uh, I can't do the last little bit with T3 because I don't have a high enough repair score and I can't seem to make that happen. I've finished everything I can with the Handmaiden. Unless there... Oh, that's right, that's right. I meant to check and see if there were any force powers that I could teach her. Yes. Uh, what are you doing? Can I, can you teach me some more fighting moves? Never mind. Okay. So there's nothing I can teach her right now. I wonder. Is there anything I can teach Bowder? Yes, General. There we go. I can teach him a bunch of stuff. Uh, I want to teach Don't you some worry, of the forms. Yeah. He's learned the saber Thank you, form. General. That might... Yes, General. Don't worry, I'm a... And he's learned Thank another you, saber General. form. Th yes, General. Don't worry, right. I'm a quick learner. Yep, you are. And another Thank saber you, form. General. Yes, General. Alright. Uh, some techniques. Think help? I think it will help. He's learned foresight. Take practice. Yes, Oddly General. enough. If you think um, help. What else can I teach him? Breath control. It'll take That's useful, but sort of. Yes, General. If you think they'll help. And beast trick. It'll take practice, eh. but I think I can pick that up. I don't know that. Yes, don't spend General. too much time on beast trick. If you think they'll help. Affect mind. 
<laughs> Ironic, yes, given that you can't help. use it with them, but sure. Do you think they'll help? Dominate mine? Again, ironic, because you can't use that. Yes, General. Uh, some fighting Let's techniques. Work, then, what else can he learn? Oh, he's learned two-weapon fighting. And a good yes, Too bad General. he's never going to use two-weapon fighting. Let's get to work then, General. Uh, improved two-weapon fighting? Oh, even better. He, he's got an improved version of a skill he's never yes, going to use. Let's get to work then, General. And master two up and fighting. He's mastered a skill that he's never going to use. Yes, General. Uh, any shields? Never mind. All right, but at least we've got him as squared away as we can. Let's see if there's anything left to teach visas. We've already done everything we can with her conversation-wise. Uh, so I wanted to teach you some of the forms. In mind and body for your teachings. Let's see. Oh, we're in a saber form. Now. <laughs> uh, I only taught you to make you stronger, not to serve me. I do not understand, but the choice is mine whether you permit it or not. Mm -hmm. All right, I'll be going now. Actually, not quite. My life for yours. Uh, there we go. I want to teach you some of the forms. I have prepared both. Another saber form. All right. I do. Not I will answer what I can. All right. I think I got to do a new My conversation each time, don't I? Oh, how did you find me? Who sent you? All right. Nope. Sweet. She has learned everything that I can teach her. Uh, Mandalore, we've done everything we can. Let's try Mira. Yeah, something wrong? No grenades, questions, talk. I want to teach you Is some of the forms. There we go. Meditation stuff. That puts me to sleep. Oh, hush. And she learned Got to save it. her form. Uh, yeah, something wrong? All right. What else can this we do? Not be any of that Another Got save it. her form. Uh, yeah, something wrong? What else we got? Another yeah, saber form. Yeah. Okay. Wrong. Uh, techniques. Yeah. Well, all I need. <laughs> My rocket launcher and some rockets. Uh, this is something a little more subtle. I'll sure, we'll go with that. that. Crack next time you need some covering fire. <laughs> what did you want to show me? All right, foresight. All right, I think I have it. Eh. I mean, that's not useless, but yeah, I. I wrong. I don't use that as much as I probably should. What other yeah. techniques can I teach? Well, all I need is my rock. Yeah. I'll ignore that little. Breath control. All right. eh. Yeah, something. That's wrong. not bad. That. I probably should be a little less down on breath control because if you know you're walking into a poison field, you can do the breath control power, which will protect you from poisons. And that means that gear that's normally taking up a slot for the sole purpose of blocking poison can can now be used for other things. Yeah. I'll ignore that little crack yeah, next yeah, time yeah. you need some covering fire. What, what do you want to show, show me? me? Beast trick? Right. Eh. Yeah. I hate yeah. that everybody's learning that beast trick. Like like there there's Yeah. I'll it, ignore that little I mean, crack it's next not horrible, but fire. It's what very situational. If it if the game didn't give it to you, and All right. I, I I find it kind of yeah, funny that everybody's on. learning affect mind. Yeah. I'll ignore. Because uh, and dominate All mind. Because right. none of them Something can wrong. use that ability in conversation. Some grenades. All right, fighting techniques. Yeah. Weapon specialization right, lightsaber. All right, there we go. That that's been a useful okay. addition. Uh, grenades. Oh, okay, that's it. We're done. I've taught you everything that I can. You're about as upgraded as we can. I don't think I. I hate that I never get to the final thing with Goto, but uh, it seems to be one of those things that uh, I just kind of ran out of 
I, I didn't utilize him as much as I should have. Something up? Uh, some of the forms I've learned. All right, I'm game. What did you want to show me? All right, he's learning the etcher. I'll be sure to make use of it. Yeah, hang on, up. we're not done. Uh, some of the forms. All right, I'm game. What did you? And he learned another Got saber it. form. Something up. Pazak, Pazak. Questions? Never mind. All right, so he's about as good as we're gonna get him. Those two are about as good as we're going to get them. Last thing to do is to talk to Kriya. I am at level 28. And just a little too far away. I, I'd need 4,000 XP. And I'm out of quests. There's no, there's nowhere left to fight and get uh, just that little bit more XP. So I'm not going to be able to uh, upgrade the crystal. We must go to Dantooine to the Enclave. Oh. There is something there that you must hear if you are to understand. Okay. I have no time for questions, and any answers will have to wait until we stand within the Enclave together. Okay. So she's not going to talk, and it's time to go to the Enclave. <laughs> All right. All right, so I, I wish I'd realized that this part was going to be as short as it was. Otherwise, I wouldn't have made the last one as long as it is. Yeah, I know. I know. Uh, a bunch of them end up mastering skills they're never going to use. Uh, you, you teach almost all of them mind trick and dominate mind, and they can't use them. I, I don't know why the game doesn't. Uh, teaching some of the lightsaber specializations, that's good. Uh, teaching Baudur the two-weapon fighting, I mean, I guess that could be good. I, I, I could I, actually, well, I don't know. Um, I might change that. So he uses the blaster one-handed and gets the benefit of the dueling feat. And then give him two lightsabers so he can make the most of the two-weapon fighting feat. That's a thought. But uh, let me insert a quick cut and take a short break. Well, that was fun. Unless I just died. Then it was a little less than fun. I hope you've enjoyed. I hope you're having fun. And if you want to watch live, you can follow along on Twitch. I live stream the recording of the next six episodes at least once a week. I might even throw in some bonus content here and there if time allows. And you'll find the link in the description below. Also, if you haven't already, please subscribe to the YouTube channel. That way you'll get notified when new episodes go up, live stream archives from some of my other stuff, and various and sundry other videos. Because I do more than just this. And if you want to get notifications, don't forget to hit the bell. And if you really, truly enjoyed it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and all that good fun stuff. If you have any questions, queries, quips, quotes, comments, complaints, or other whatnot, don't forget to leave those in the comments down below. Lastly, if you're enjoying the show, if you're getting some value out of it, then consider giving a lot of value back. Go to live.anonjunior.com. It'll take you to the Streamlabs page where you can tip or donate, however you want to think about it. And there's no preset amount because this is a straight up value for value proposition. So if you're getting value out of the show and you would like to give a little value back, even if it's just enough for a cheap cup of coffee, then uh, consider going, giving a little bit, especially if it tickled the nostalgia or opened your eyes to a new game that you might play. And uh, with all that said and done, we're, uh, we're going to cut out, have fun, enjoy, and I'll see you next time.